The Environmental Leadership Area Focus in the Halton District School Board's 2020 to 2024 multi-year plan is designed to take action for a sustainable world. The goal is to deepen opportunities to learn about connections between ecosystems, social justice, and climate, elevate local environmental initiatives and practices, and design and manage learning environments that demonstrate a commitment to sustainable development. In this video, you will see how HDSB elementary and secondary classrooms are bringing this key area of the multi-year plan to life. So I'm looking at all of the different earths that everyone has added here. And I would say about our average is almost three, three and a half earths that we would need to support our lifestyle. But how many earths do we have? One. So what's the next question is, how can we reduce our carbon footprint? The environmental leadership area of focus of the multi-year plan is an important part of my classroom program because it is the framework that bases all of the connections of the curriculum. I use the sustainable development goals to connect with a variety of tasks in the classroom. And these tasks give students the opportunity to practice sustainability because ultimately it's a skill that we need to develop so that we can encourage, empower, and foster uh, leaders to take on a changing world. Our first station is a carbon footprint calculator. We had the students calculate their digital carbon footprint online, and they found out that the average student in our class uses 3.5 Earths to support their lifestyle. Um, and that was really shocking to them because obviously we only have one Earth, and so we asked, what can we do to reduce our carbon footprint? As an environmental leader, I can help plant plants and trees that would help and enhance biodiversity. We can also waste less food so that we're not putting as much energy into producing and growing the food just for it to go into the garbage. So folks, we know that uh, we've been in a lot of talk about sustainability and about leadership in our classes. Uh, today is a great opportunity for us to be hands-on and experiential in actually doing that. So this is us taking what we've been learning and putting it into action. So in my grade 11 environmental science class, we've been learning about genetic diversity uh, and the value of genetic diversity. So it's great to have an opportunity to do something about this concept. So we are currently in a forest that has an invasive species in it called garlic mustard that will eventually overtake all of the understory here so that you're no longer going to see any of the normal flowers that we see in spring if that is left unchecked. So my grade 11 students prepared a, a workshop to deliver to the Hawthorne Village grade 6 students. They taught them about what an invasive species is, um, showed them how to identify garlic mustard, and then led them through the forest here to be able to identify the garlic mustard, pull the garlic mustard, and you know, as grade 6 is making it a contest, uh, is, is a blast for the students as well. So um, not only are we learning about this concept, but we have an opportunity to increase the health of this forest and minimize the human impacts in the area here. The key for me uh, for raising up the next generation of environmental leaders uh, is to be able to take action. The message I want to give the younger generation is that uh, whatever impact they leave on this planet is it going to affect the generation that will come after them and, and it's important that we leave uh, a good impact so that the generations that are going to follow us are left in good hands. As you have seen, the Halton District School Board's 2020 to 2024 multi-year plan is an important document that sets the direction and prioritizes our efforts as an organization to support our 66,000 students and 11,000 staff members. With environmental leadership as one of five areas of focus in the plan, Halton District School Board schools continue to help students learn, grow and inspire.